Hi marketers, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can create a LinkedIn newsletter, something like this. In my opinion, newsletter is a great way to write about a topic or your interest on a regular basis. The members can also subscribe to your newsletter and whenever you post something new, they will be updated about it. I think overall, it's a great way to build your brand on LinkedIn and to show your expertise on a certain subject. So to create a newsletter, make sure you do have a LinkedIn account. The best thing is that you can create a newsletter as a company or you can also create a newsletter under your personal account. Uh, for this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how you can create LinkedIn newsletter under your company page. Um, it's basically the same process. So what you're gonna do is click write article over here. And then on the top section, you will see this button that says create a newsletter, click that. And then you have to enter your newsletter title. So let's put that as marketing stuff provide a description about your newsletter so i'm going to call this as content marketing in 90 seconds how often do you want to publish so i'll put that as monthly maybe i want to publish an article once a month and then all you have to do is click upload image and i'm going to just add my picture for now and click open so this is going to be your logo or any sort of image that you want to present on your newsletter feed the thing that you need to remember is that you can only have one newsletter per page so please make a note of that once you're done with that you can click done and then you should be able to see your newsletter name over here so every time you're going to publish an article it will be published as a part of your newsletter if you want to publish just a simple article like an individual article you can do that as well so i'm going to keep that for now and over here we do have pre-built blocks that you can use to publish your article so you can type your uh, heading so cold calling versus content marketing you can also add a cover photo over here of your choice and then you can start writing your content on this section so normally i create that content on a google document and then i publish it over here so i'm just gonna paste it over here to show you what it looks like and you can always format it by going into it um so yeah it's very easy to create all of these articles if you want to play around with the aesthetics you can make a certain text bold italics or underline you can also link it to a certain url of your choice so for this example i'm just gonna link it to google.com i will click apply perfect um so that's basically how you create a linkedin article as well and if you want to add a certain image or like a video you can just click the icon over here click image and then upload it from your computer if all of this looks good and let's say you are ready to publish you can hit the button that says publish and over here you will get a preview of your post and the image that you put over here will be reflected on this section and you can write out a caption that says hey check out my newsletter or something like that and then just hit publish once you do that all of your subscribers will be notified that you have launched a new newsletter after this your once you hit publish your subscribers and anybody that is connected to you on linkedin will be notified about it and now let's say if you want to get access to all the newsletter you have published so far you can go back to your home screen and scroll down and click discover more and then click the newsletter section over here and i can see the marketing stuff newsletter i can see the subscribers i have and if i go down i can see all the newsletters that have been published by me so if i click this one for example i can scroll down and yeah i wrote this newsletter article about you know free tools that content marketers can use so yeah that's basically it and if you scroll back up a really interesting thing is that you can click view stats and over here you can see the impressions your article has received the engagement the performance of the article and also you can learn a bit more about the people who actually interacted with your post you can filter them out based on job title 
location so this means that most of the people that read my newsletter is from gda so that's it i hope you guys enjoyed this video found it helpful don't forget to subscribe to my channel to watch more of such videos and i shall see you guys in my next one till then take care bye